What's good YouTube man, it's your boy J4 here with another video. In today's video I got you guys with the most toxic, best lockdown build on NBA 2K25 next gen. Obviously you know I'm going to come out with the next, uh, current gen version of it later on today. So, this build is absolutely toxic. You'll be able to get so many stops, so many steals, bumps, intercepts, all that stuff. So without wasting any more of y'all's time, man, let's just jump right into it and get it going. So, Heinous and Jersey does not matter. So position, you want to go shooting guard. If y'all want to take this to the rec, though, I recommend doing small forward. It's going to change the shades of, but this stuff is still the same. So for the height, we went six foot six. A lot of locks, you know, they go six seven, but this year six sixes are just insane. Two hundred thirty-five pounds, and then a seven-two wingspan. Let me just go ahead and fix something real quick. My bad. Um, and yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. So a 7-2 wingspan. And yeah. So for the finishing category, obviously we're a lock. So I'm going to do the main ones first. So we got a 65 driving dunk and then a 75 standing dunk. Now, you really, that's OD. Y'all can really go down to 72 and 62. But, you know, just in case, you know, y'all can do this, right? Y'all can still dunk the ball really well. You know, you're going to be doing some backdoor cuts and stuff. It's not really, you know, driving to the paint and stuff like that. So keep that in mind. And yeah, driving lane is going to go to a 55. Like I said, you're going to get a lot of standing dunks and driving dunks, so you don't have to really worry about that if you take up smart shots. And yeah. So now the mid range of three point. Three pointer goes to a 83, so we do unlock that limitless range and dead eye on bronze. And then mid range stays at a 73. Now you could, of course, bring up your mid range to an 85 to get that dead eye, but that's really up to you. So yeah, free throw goes to a 61. This is a park build, so let's go ahead and keep that in mind. Pass accuracy is going to be a 65. My ball handle is going to go to a 70, and then a 71 speed with ball, or 75 speed with ball, my bad, because of some other stuff that goes up on the build. <clears throat> Excuse me, man. My, my, guys, my throat is killing me right now. I ain't going to lie. So go ahead, and now for the defense. This is where it gets real good. So 64 interior. Right, it's kind of lackluster. We'll go ahead and skip over the perimeter and steal real quick. 68 block to get that chase down. Alright, so, and then also rebound goes to a 60 on that defensive so you can get that rebound chaser on bronze. Now, perimeter is going to go to a 97. So you guys are going to get Hall of Fame Challenger, Hall of Fame on ball Menace, Hall of Fame Pick Dodger once we get it up. And yeah, the steal goes all the way up to a 94. So you'll be able to get Hall of Fame Interceptor. Obviously, if you guys want to use your, you know, Max Plus Ones, y'all can go ahead and get Legend Challenger, you know, Legend Interceptor. Also, your Cat Breakers. You can get your Cat Breakers upgraded to a, uh, a lot as well. And, yeah. So the defense is looking crazy good. Now, the physical is also going to match that. So we're going to go 90 on the speed, 86 on the agility to end up getting that on-ball menace and that pick dodger. So once we do get the 99 perimeter from our Cat Breakers, we could end up getting Legend on Ball Menace. Strength is going to go to an 85. And then the Vertical is going to go to a 67. So like I said, we get that High Flying Denier. Our defense is absolutely insane with Hall of Fame Challenger, Hall of Fame On Ball Menace, Hall of Fame Pick Dodger, Off Ball Pass, and Immovable Enforcer is also on Gold. Now you guys can get that up to uh, Gold or Hall of Fame as well if you just bring up your Cat Breakers with your Strength. But yeah, hold on guys, excuse me. But yeah, it was basically a crazy build. It's, it's really toxic, obviously, with that 97 perimeter, 94 steel. You guys have 90 speed, 86 agility, so you guys are moving fast. But yeah, before we get into the shades up and the build name, I do want to ask y'all boys to go ahead and leave a like down below. It really helps push out the videos, you know, in my channel. As well as while you're down there, subscribe if you guys are not. I do post the videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And yeah. For both next gen and current gen videos. Now, of course, let's go ahead and jump into these. So, obviously, if you depending on the you know position you make it, if you make it shooting guard or small forward, your shades up will be different. But for the shooting guard, you have Alex Caruso, Doug Christie, and Herb Jones, and you built a three and D two guard. Now, it's been your boy J Fo. See you guys on my next video. Peace.